Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Today's video is going to be on how to keep track of your schedule. If you guys are interested, let's get into the nitty gritty. So once you get established in your unit, most of the time they'll have uh, some sort of scheduling software or uh, some way to fill in your schedule. However it is, whatever how they have it set up in your unit, it's kind of confusing sometimes to keep track of the days that you scheduled yourself for or that you've been scheduled to work. So what you can do is what I've seen a lot of people do is just jot it down in an agenda or a planner or maybe on the calendar app on your phone. But I've been using this app um, that I was told about when I first started and I've been using it for about three years and I've never missed a shift and I've never messed up on my schedule where like a day was put down incorrectly. And I have to say it's been able to give me some peace as far as like having my my life set. So like let's say someone asks me, hey, do you work this day? I'll just literally screenshot my schedule that I've jotted down in the app and I'll send it to them. And most of the time people don't understand what it is, but I'm gonna explain it when I go, I'm gonna do like a screen record of the app so you can see how to use it. But anyways, this app, this particular app is called Nurse Grid. And the reason why I like it is because it's pretty easy to use and all you have to do is pick your your days. So let's say you schedule yourself on, for instance, 18, 19, 20, you just put add and just 18, 19, 20 and you just save it. And then if you work at another work site, you just pick the work site, add, and then you put in those days. I'm going to show you now what I'm, what I'm talking about because it's kind of confusing, just like, oh, okay. But it's it's a really easy app to use and I love it. I, this is not a sponsored video or anything, although I wish it was, but I just want to like spread the wealth as far as information that I can offer and I have to say this app is literally life itself. Just saying. Um, anyway, I'm just rambling here. I'm going to go over to the phone, show you how to use it on my app and then I'll come back. Okay, perfect. So, you're going to go to the app store, you're going to type in Nurse Grid. And it's going to be this one right here. Okay. I have it already downloaded, so I'm going to open it up. Create an account. I'm going to put in an email. My name. Okay, perfect. Made an account. So this is the screen you'll normally see, and here's where you can put in your shifts. So what you want to do is first pick your work site. You're going to go to add and add a work site. Um, just for now, I'm going to pick a random hospital. I'm going to put Jackson Memorial in Miami. Perfect and any department. Mm, whatever. And then you're normally you want to put in your shift. So let's say it's 7p. And it sets your your end time already. Okay, so then all you have to do is literally tap on the date that you're scheduled and it'll save your shift. So you just pick your days and call it a day. And save that's it see so it, it keeps track of the shifts that you have for the week and if you notice there's little moons this the little tree means it's Christmas it's a holiday but the little moons that they're that they're nights so let's say you pick up a day shift you just change the start time to 7a and put a random day and it'll be a little Sun so those are nights and those are days then if you have an on-call shift you change the event type to on-call and you put your day. Let's say you wanna pick up a shift. You can put that you're available to work this days, or if you wanna make sure that you don't schedule yourself for a certain day, let's say you have a dance recital on this day, you'll put it like that, and that way you don't, when you're picking your schedule, you don't pick that. So what I like about this app is that it keeps track of all your shifts, and if you have friends that work at that um the location that that you're working you can you can 
actually see their schedule as well. Um, so if you have friends that you want to coordinate with, maybe you want to get together on a day off, you can schedule and see what day, which days are, are better for you guys or whatever. Now, if you work at another work site, you can put in another work site. Let's say you work at Baptist. This is fine, whatever. And you just pick a, a different color location, like a different color for that location. So then when you go to add, sorry, when you go to add your shift, you're just gonna change your work site and pick your shifts as you go. So then you'll see that you work this day, these days at one location, and then these days at another location. So that way you can also keep track of your other jobs. That way you don't get confused and, and all that. I really like this app because I never miss a day or like anything like that. And then there's a the possibility to swap if you want. Like if your friends, I don't have any colleagues yet. If your friends have, have days that you want to swap, you can send like a note. Like, hey, I'd like to swap this day with you or something, you know. And... And it'll send it to your colleague and if they want to you know they can text you back and be like sure that works for me and you can message them through here so it's pretty cool i really like the app and i have like in my in the app that i that i have um it's uh i have it so that i can see my schedule and everything like that with my per diem and and my on calls so that's what I really like about it, and it's a pretty cool app, I gotta say. Okay, I already logged out. Moving on. Okay, pretty easy to use, right? I, I just, I felt like I needed to explain a little how to use it, because if you don't pick the work site, then you can't add the, the um, your days. But let's say you, you work in a, in a work site that is not listed on the work sites, that's okay. You can put it in, and explain what it is. Let's say you work for a transport company and all you do is like on-call pickups for, for patients from one facility to the next. Mm -hmm. So what you can do is type the name of, let's say the company that you're using, let's say it's EMS Medical, I don't know. And when you type EMS Medical, it's not in the work sites. You just type EMS Medical and then let them know that you wanna add the work site. It might take a day or two and then it'll add the worksite to the worksite lists and then you can use it and pick your on-call days or your days that you're working. And I like that because it's like, it's specific for where you're working, not just like you just pick days because then you can pick the, the hospital, the unit and everything like that and your friends can be using it and then you can see your colleague schedules, even though it's kind of invasive, but that way if you need to make a switch or anything like that, you can kind of have an idea more or less of the days that they're working. Or maybe you wanna go and have mimosas and brunch. Then you can see what days you're not working and plan accordingly. The reason why I like this app is because it just structures my life more and I just, I feel like I need that. Like I'm the kind of person that I need to have to-do lists and it helps me stay focused, organized, and centered. So I hope it helps you. That's it for this video, guys. If you like this video, like it down below. Please subscribe if you haven't already and I'll catch you in my next video. Bye!